Hello there and welcome back. Okay, seems the trout is already approaching, so uh, that didn't take too long. Previous episodes have been a bit rough. I think we have recovered pretty, pretty well. So, um, yeah, contaminated adults, just one left. This means... Oh yeah, that is paused, everything else is paused, so we are, we are good. The focus for today's episode is to finish off this section over here. We've got, well, 0 0.3 days left, so we're not going to be able to construct everything right. So our food numbers are pretty, pretty low, so we're going to have to make some changes. First of all, let's do a quick... The drought has started. Okay, so six days, so that's not too bad. I'm sure we can survive that. Our next priority, yeah, let's get this farm done. The highest priority, and we are going to have some workers in here as well. This is corn. What do we have here? Corn as well. Eggplant. Okay, how about this farm? Let's get you... Well, they're not fully grown just yet, are they? No. What about the farms over here? Okay, we can do another beaver. This one already has two, so that is... That is very good. Then we are replanting the mangroves. And what are you up to? I think you're replanting some things and trees as well. Over here, let's just have a quick check. We've got some uh, spare beavers right now. Uh, no, all of those farms are fully staffed, so that's okay. So whilst we are waiting for the farms and other stuff to be built, uh, let's return over here. Now, um, <laughs> the way we can regulate or manage the bad side, it, the, well, I guess there's a few different ways how we could do it. So we seem to be going or gravitating towards the automated uh, floodgate system, but I suppose... Because I did notice that with the... Where are you? Oh dear. Okay, so when we have those pumps over here, those deep water pumps, they only um, take out the, or remove the water. And if we look over here as well, we have a separate deep water pump, which we are using over here. So I was thinking like... So look, deep water mechanical fluid pump. If we use these ones and create it like um, <laughs> Where do we have a better section? This one might be a little bit easier to demonstrate. We can't really place you anywhere. But it could act as a bit of a filter over here. So if we place you down, and if we had a bit more space over here, like three, four, maybe a bit more, we, we could just filter all the water out naturally. Well, mechanically, I mean. So all the clean water would be pumped over here and the dirty water or the bad water will be left on the other side. I mean, we'd need a bit of a better setup, I suppose, but um, but yeah. So um, until we have a bit more power and figured out exactly how we want to change things up, right now we are going to build our things over here. Okay, we can do another platform as well. Let's just quickly build this section up so um, roads can go here. Hmm, it would be lovely if they start using the levees and walking over here. Well, I'll just speed up the time just a tiny bit. Let's put a set of stairs for the beavers as well. Now, will they be... Oh, I know. The reason... Well, never mind. We're going to have to remove one of those sections because I'm thinking to block them in. Well, I don't mean to block them in. I just want to start putting those levees down where they need to go. Hold on a second. We've got seven spare, actually eight spare beavers. So why don't we help ourselves just a little bit by building a another builder's hut. And over here, let's just get rid of those trees as well. And we can probably do another one. Now, I know myself pretty well already. And I'm definitely going to forget about it. So I think we'll do another builder's hut just across the, the road of the hauling post. Oh, talking about haulers. We should probably, yeah, I should probably have some more in here as well. But I, I think we need the builders a little bit, a little bit more than the haulers right now. So yeah, so the plan is levies over here. I think that is about the height that we are after. And there's a few roads we can remove. No, hmm. <laughs> Okay, let's give it a try. We are going to place levees in a tower just like so. Actually, we should have already doubled it up because it seems we have the space now. Okay, so that's going up. Now, the goal for the beavers is to construct everything or all the platforms first. I don't think we need the last one, or do we? I could probably pause this one. Save a few uh, few bits of resources. Okay, here we go. Uh, this one actually is going to be a levy or a few levels because we can only do the triple 
triple floodgates right now. Now, all these trees need to go as well. Same on probably this side. Actually, let's create ourselves a little bit more space. Okay, then we'll put some roads, some ladders, and block this area off just a, just a little bit. Okay, you guys, if we prioritize this section here. Okay, so now that they can climb up, that is the next priority. Oh, never mind. They are just building things so quickly now as well that I think we are a-okay. So, um, what happens if we remove those roads? Should be fine, but if we remove this section over here, they are going to be stuck. But not to worry, that's going to be built pretty quickly. How are things over here? Have we blocked off this zone? Oh, okay. We need another levy right about there and... Uh, Hold on a second. Food numbers seem to be going up, so that's good. Yeah. I guess we have done something right. Uh, a couple of platforms over here. Okay, so that section should be done pretty quickly as well. Now, let's have a look at our settings real quick. I'll speed up the time so we can skip the night, hopefully. When the drought starts, we're going to block everything off. When the drought ends... Uh, let's set it to 2.5 for the time being. When the band tide starts, we're going to drop the height to zero. And when the band tide ends, um, should we do 2.5 again? Because there is going to be a bit of band tide stuff left in here. Actually, let's do two. Yeah, that should be fine. And these things can always remain 2.5. Over here, we are going to do a... Actually, yeah, we, we could probably queue this up already. Let's grab the triple one. Okay, so you're going to go here and pretty much the same thing. When the trout starts, let's just um, raise them all the way up. When you end, 2.5. And then uh, bad diet starts, drop to zero and then go to go to two. Okay. I mean, we can probably adjust this a little bit later as well. I just want to have a few numbers already in place. And while you look at that, those beavers are pretty happy to run around. Just going to remove you over there real quick. A few levees. Block this off. I don't suppose we'll get it done before the drought ends. But, um... Do you know what? It's it's fine. So, um... Quite a bit for you guys to build. We... Hmm... <laughs> we got some spare beavers as well. Well, not anymore. Got a few spare jumps, but there's, uh, Yeah, quite a few huts over here. Now, the next things... Let's have a look over here. Nothing to do in range. So, we can probably pause a few more buildings. Get a couple more builders, hopefully. Uh, who else is complaining? We've got an injured beaver over here. I am pretty certain we had some houses of healing. Oh, yes, we do. Medical beds. So that's going to help them a little bit. Lax materials. Oh, smelter. Yes, we don't have any more scrap metal, so you can go. All right. So um, how is our power doing right now? 1,200 supply. Demand is 200, but that's because it's nighttime. Well, anyways, I think things are pretty good. We should skip the night and then let's have a look. What shall we do next? Right. So our next project should be probably to try and finish off this area here as well. It looks uh, very unnatural how it's uh, being kind of like clean cut over here and... Um, Hold on, are we losing quite a bit of water in here as well? Yes, we are. Um, right, right, right. So you are maxed out right now. Why don't we drop a little bit more water so we could start planting some more trees, I suppose. Let's see. Do we... Oh, right. Hmm. I guess we lost quite a bit of water over here when the... Uh, yeah, when the drought started. So, um, okay. that that That's okay. We'll leave you at 2.5 and... Let's jump back over here. So, yeah. We'd like to finish off this zone. A few things we'll do is let's create some more sort of natural looking roads in here. All of those trees are going to go. And I believe we'd like to... Let's cut through right about here. Okay. These trees can go as well. Then I'm not really sure where we're going to connect this just yet. But um, what I am thinking... If we grab a few platforms, I'm thinking to move, yeah, those bumps out of the way as well. Now, this looks like a bit of a centralized location. So I do want to put, uh, not over there, but this one here. Okay, a few platforms. And the idea is how many science points do we have? We have enough, it seems. And if we grab the bridges, okay, you're, you're only 200. So that is okay. 
one over there, second, third, fourth, just like so. All right, connect them with the roads right in the middle as well. Tap one through there. And the last thing we want to do in here is get rid of this tree. Okay, cool. And now in here, let me just speed up the time a little bit more. So this is where we can... Yeah, we're going to go this way. Then let's do another road through here, bit over here. And what we are going to do is let's measure out... The, um, the zone where we want to put the forester. We've done maybe just a little bit too many roads in here. The forester could be a... Hmm, yeah, that's quite a lovely spot over here. Right, so there we go. Forester's going to help us replant and bring this place alive. I, I think we want to have it... How far? Okay, I think we have a quick autosave. That's why it's lagging a little bit. Okay, pretty good overlap over here. But it feels like those roads are just a little bit too straight, aren't they? Yeah, let's bring you in just a tiny bit more. Okay, this location's a little bit better. Uh, let's do it a tiny bit more. Okay, happy. We can be quite happy with this, this area now. Now, we're not done just yet. A few more things we'd like to build in here is ease the tapper shack. Okay, that fits very nicely over here. And <laughs> since we are going to be collecting some uh, sap over here, or whatever it was called, let's just have a quick look. So, container. Oh, it's the resin. I don't know why I called it the sap. Anyways, yeah, the pine resin. That's what we're collecting here. So, we'll have a container. Actually, never mind. What we want to have in here, a little bit closer to us, is a water container. Let's do this one over here. Okay. And then small warehouse could could be placed like... I think we'll do it over here for the time being. And then to sort of like complete this area, we're going to do one of those lumberjack flags as well. So it's like a nice little forester that's uh, sort of living here. Um, sorry, no, this is his workplace. And this looks more like his house. I mean, of course, yeah, that's the tapper shack. But, you know, he could be living in here. And then uh, we're going to create like a bit of a forest around him as well. I, I guess we can leave all this in place in here. So a uh, couple of trees. I'm just going to place them down. Few over here. Uh, might be easier if we just fill this zone like so. And then um, we'll mix it up with a few different trees. I don't want to leave those roads in place. They can go around as well. But um, since it is not too much in our way, I know it's... Uh, Okay, just to mix it up a little bit. And this is going to be our harvesting zone. Yeah, this is where we where we will be cutting down the trees. All right, few birches here as well. I think that should be should be fine, right? And then a few over here. Okay, that looks good. Few blueberries as well. All right, now let's have a look. Okay, no, we don't want to be cutting down. Uh, the forest around this zone in here, but we are going to leave this one in place. Okay, we'll um, let the beavers construct this area up a little bit. Oh, hold on a second. We were supposed to do those roads here as well. So quick change. We are going to take those out. You are going to go up from here. And now what we can do is, yeah, let's just go up a few through and through there as well. That should be pretty good. And then we can also remove uh, hold on a second. Something happened. Okay, all of those trees in here. Not this one. We're happy with this. Oh, look at that. Trout is finally over. And then, uh, yeah, once they clear this up, we're going to do another tapper shack somewhere in the middle over here. And then we should be fine. Okay, so what's happening over here? We've got some water coming in. Triple the speed. Food is looking very juicy and lovely. Oh dear, we've got a lot of jobs. So I believe it's time to pause a few buildings. And we... Probably want to have a few more haulers as well now, don't we? Um, right, right, right. I mean, water is pretty uh, pretty full. So we should probably uh, relieve a few beavers. Okay, let, let's see how this area fills up with water first. So, um, yeah, so everything's going through nicely. They've built up the wall pretty quickly as well, which is awesome. Okay, here we go. The water level is now approaching our... Oh, you're just flowing through here. 
Well, I think we should be fine because it's filling up. It's, um, it should come through here as well. It's 2.5. Yeah, just give it some time. I mean, we've got quite a few water sources over here. So it's just going to build up and um, we'll see. Let's let's give it a minute and we'll, we'll see how it performs. Right, so very interesting. We have given it a few minutes. It's not started to spill just yet. We should probably pause you for a little while as well because they aren't going to complain. Oh, hold on a second. Never mind. We didn't give them enough minutes, but um, but yeah, it seems to be working somewhat now. A bit of glitching over here, but Nothing to worry about, I suppose. You guys are complaining as well. Let's um, let's try and help you cross over first. Okay. And just going to place these ladders over here so they can sort of climb down and place down a few platforms for their bridges. What's happened? Oh, yeah. These are those buildings here. Never mind. Uh, bring back the water level. Things are still working, right? Oh, yes, they are. Uh, water height and uh, okay I give you the highest of priorities but no one's really come here to fix this pretty certain oh we might have to hmm hold on a second I'm pretty sure it's out of range oh yes it is okay not to worry control click over there we've got the the ladders in place uh, hold on a second one more time bring you guys over as well it seems we have another tree in here. Let's just uh, cut this one down. We should be fine. We can uh, see a few beavers already cross over to come and help us out. Okay, levies in here. Four of you. And the rest should be pretty easy. I think over here, we're just going to fill this space up a little bit. All right, yeah, so pretty uh, pretty straightforward. We're just going to do a ladder over here. Let them climb up. Uh, quickly get this built. Well, it's nighttime right now, but... Uh, Cut down those trees and uh, then fill this up with, with levees. Because I think five floodgates should be enough to control all of that extra volume of water that we have in this area. Okay, so whilst they are doing this, one more second. Let me see. They've already done this section here as well. Well, you guys are very fast, aren't you? Okay, other projects. We do want to start moving into metal soon. But to even think about it, we, we need quite a few gears gears and uh, treated blanks so gears we are producing over here got a few extra buildings which is great and they um i think next one yeah we, we don't have a whole lot of blanks which is unfortunate we can do i think it's easier if we place some um <laughs> let's see blank factories oh hold on a second we got quite a lot of space up here as well no this space might be better for our treated planks, isn't it? You guys are going to climb over, climb over, and a tiny little platform. Okay, roads, probably highest priority, so you can be happy as quick as possible. And the next step, uh, let's have a look, wood workshop. So you're going to take quite a few things. Bind resin, we... Uh, are we collecting this already? Um, hold on a second. I, I think we have a bit of a situation over here. Oh dear, what have we done? I think I know what we have done. So when the drought ends, we should drop you guys to 0 0.5. Um, <laughs> 0 0.5. Oh, hold on a second. Right. So you are 0 0.5. When the drought ends, yep, 0 0.5 over here. Now we just have to find the right platform. Uh, not the platform, the flat gate. Here we go. 0 0.5 over there. Uh, what are you guys doing? Which one of you was the one with the settings? Oh dear, we've got two of them here. A bit of a mix-up. So you can be 0 0.5. And then... What about you? You're on 0. Which I think is good. I'm just going to pause the water for a second. Um, I speed up the time. Let's see what happens over here. Okay. We're stabilizing it a little bit. Maybe... Okay. Where is it? Zero. Okay, so drop it on zero then when the drought ends. And you're still spilling over. That is okay. I think what we are going to do for now... Let's just drop you at something ridiculously low. Okay. 
Where are all the beavers? They should be constructing this area. Maybe we'll give you a bit of a higher priority. Okay, there we go. Now, the next thing we can do here as well is... Uh, let's get rid of those levees. I don't think we need them. Okay, there we go. All that water is starting to go that way. And... Yeah, they have access, so they can build up that zone as well, which is which is great. Too far to construct this. Well, why don't we give you a bit of a road over there? Let's um, unlock the wood workshop. Okay, so you can go there. I'm just going to plan in a few extra ones here. Uh, you need logs, 20 of them, 40 planks, 40 gears to bring the power up. We are going to go this way, that way. Okay, unlock and... All right, a few roads in here as well. Now, whilst we are waiting for the things to be built, let's have a look. So water is pretty full, tons of food, which is lovely. I mean, I do want to, of course, increase this even further. Nothing to do in range, so we can pause you. Yep, we don't really need you for the time being. And then for the roads, I guess we are going to go down through... Yeah, that's looking pretty good over here. We don't have anyone to get rid of those trees because they are very busy. Oh, well, you look at that. It's uh, coming along pretty nicely. I'm going to bring it up to two. Let's see what happens. Of course, I don't want to flood the whole colony. Maybe just a little bit. What about yours? Okay, so 2.5. There seems to be a lot of complaining that we see around this place, but um, that's just because the construction is pretty far from the homes. Oh yeah, some of them don't even make it home before it's morning again, so pretty lengthy travel times. It's definitely something we, we shall fix in the future. We, we just want to get this area built over here. There's no point creating like another, another district, so... Um, yeah, we're, we're not too far. They're just con finishing off the last floodgate, it seems. Right, so it appears that we have quite a few spare jumps for, for the beavers. Now, to fix this up, I have a ton of foresters over here that I believe we no longer need. I mean, this is pretty sad that they don't replant the, um, the sort of normal forest over here. Well, things seem to be good. We've got a slightly more direct route here as well. They seem to have removed all of the trees. So we can create another network of roads. And I definitely do want to have another tapper shack. So let's just change the roads a tiny bit. What would be cool if it goes... Does it matter where it goes? Oh, we could slide you in about here as well. Let's do another road so you can... Uh, <laughs> you'll be taking care of this area, which is fine. Okay, yeah. Actually, let's just uh, change it up a little bit. Let's create like a little another alley over here like a forest alley yeah and then um i mean with water let's leave the water by the road so it's a little bit closer i suppose and then we do another warehouse tiny one in here as well okay and we want them to supply we don't want to sort of bring them here all right so i think we're pretty much done decorating this place i put a few more blueberries and birch trees as well and and then i was just throwing yeah quite a quite a few pine trees over here but it, it just looks too boxy i guess yeah so i'm just trying to remove a few from here and um i mean that should do, and eventually we'll probably get rid of this road as well. We'll, we'll see what happens. Um, now, have you done the last one? Oh no, you are a little bit stuck. So maybe once we build this one, if that doesn't work, let's just do another ladder. But yeah, so it's been a pretty uh, fruitful episode, it seems. We got our water tank done. When the next bad water tide comes in, then we can see if it's actually functional or not. So um, <laughs> you're done as well. Let's bring you some water. And you seem to be complaining over there. So the road network should be done now. Yeah, loads, to, um, loads of resin we can gather over here. You have access to a few as well. So we should be building up the, the tank or the, the areas pretty, pretty soon. Let's have a look over here as well. We've got some metal Oh no, we're going to have to use the other warehouses in it. Oh well, not to worry. We can place down a few more wood workshop. It seems to be operational. And yes, we have four treated blanks already. What is the problem? The efficiency, the power seems to be a bit lower. Oh yeah. Okay, so we, we are going to need a bit more power, it seems. 
Uh, gears seem to be good. Planks are okay as well. We can just do do another one. Um, <laughs> that didn't seem to be connecting the right way. Here we go. And once that one is done, we, we should increase the efficiency a little bit. And we'll probably want to open another one up as well, don't we? Yeah, the resin's coming in, so why don't we just do that? As we were saying, the water tank is done over here. We've done a bit of an expansion, natural looking, sort of natural looking forestry area. And then in the future, we can expand to the other side of the the, the river there as well. And uh, yeah, planks, treated planks coming in. We've got two of them running, loads of the planks over there. And then as soon as we have enough, Let's have a look how many points we have. 7.6 thousand. So we need 300. That's a that's a lot. Okay, so you're going to have to go this way, right? Let's just unlock you as well. We might as well. And then... Um, <laughs> I suppose it's going to be more direct route. But it doesn't make sense if we climb over this mountain. We're going to have to go around. And in the future, we'll make those roads a little bit more natural. I suppose as well. Okay, and now climbing up from here... Doesn't really matter now, does it? We can just connect you up like so. Okay, those roads are a little doubled up, but that's okay. Yeah, we got two recipes. So the first one, let's have a look over here. We need gears and treated blanks. That gives us three scrap metal. The other option is if we add in dynamites in the mix as well. Now that's going to be interesting. I would love to see those triple dynamites and some other things. What is this thing? Extract. Okay, so we're going to have to produce quite a bit of extract it seems. Oh yeah, what I do want to keep uh, over here is all the ruins. I, I don't think we're going to cut them down in this zone. But yeah, we are one step closer to starting to get our metal production online. I think we should be able to do it in the next episode. And then the only natural next step from there is going to be the science and the bot factories. But all right, that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you soon.